Hello, my beautiful people. It is Sherry Moulton back with another video. Hope you're having an amazing day. Today is Saturday. This is the late Friday video. Yesterday was the bonus video. <laughs> so with that being said, we're going to get into this. I am blessed. I ordered from, um, let me get it right molds and shapes my brain's not working today um i ordered from molds and shapes and i ordered with the um the money that i get in my um paypal donations so i want to thank all of my um donators because <laughs> this is where my money went to so i had done my other video the first one i did was this amazing um alphabet holographic mold and I have another here. I'm just knocking things over as always. At least it's not a cup of water. Um, <clears throat> so along with that, I ordered this holographic um, coaster mold. I don't know if you can see it. Oh my goodness. I'm excited. This is what today's is going to be. And I got a bonus one. I want to thank them very much because... Um, I was expecting only two molds, but then I got this one and I, um, I'm kind of on the fence. I'm not sure it's too big for an earring, a little bit big for a necklace, <laughs> but I think it would be a cute sun catcher. It's got the hole already. So we're going to play with that. So if anyone has this mold, um, in the description, just let me know what you, what you've done with it. Cause, um, I'm not quite sure. So with that, we're going to get into this. So we're going to use my holographic mold today. And I am going to use some leftover. We're going to do blooms. We're going to do a flower bloom in it. I'm going to do a simple glitter around the edge. And with the glitters, we're going to use all of the glitters that I have caught with all my bling blings. I'm going to show you how you can use them. So with that, my friends, I'm going to get my stuff together. I'm going to mix up my resin. And as always, my resin of choice is uh, crystal resin. Um, I have the link in the description box, and I also have a discount code. It is now Sherry Molten Five with a capital S for crystal resin. And as always, I use my respirator when I am mixing. I have my gloves on. When I come back, I choose not to wear it. My choice, but you please use all your PPE to make stuff safe and stay alive and all that fun stuff so with that i'll be right back guys i'm gonna be all ready when i get back i'll see you in a second hello i am back i haven't mixed my resin up yet because i'm gonna do a bloom and i wanted to <clears throat> show you what i was doing first before i did that and then that way i'm not um because it's a time sensitive thing so i'm going to do two of them using this blue shake off glitters i don't know what's in it it's just something I have up in my cupboard. <clears throat> and I have all kinds of them. Like this one is browns and golds, but it's got a lot of broken glass and glitter um, pearls in that one. This one is, it's got a lot of glass. So these ones I'm not going to use just because there's too much glass in it. Now this has got a lot of glitter. And then the one that we used from Sunday's Bling Bling, which is the... Oh, I've just about lost it all. I'm going to shake it down here. I'm going to put it in this cup. Hopefully it'll go in there. Look at that. And that's the amazing stuff from Laura's Art Corner. All those pinks and, and there's even some glass. So we're going to put that in two, two of them. And then we'll do blue in two of them. I'm going to drop down a little bit of the alcohol ink and we're just going to pipe in some flowers. So with that, I'm going to mix my resin up and I'll be right back, guys. Okay, I have mixed up eight ounces. I'm not quite sure how many this takes. So I need to keep some for my glitter, both glitters, and some for my white. I'm going to pour that in the white for the white. I'm going to pour it in here for the gl glitter. And this for the glitter. 
Gonna give those guys a quick little stir. And I need to get a couple more sticks here, my friends. And I forgot to get my piping bag out because we're gonna pipe it in today. Stick this baggie in here and we'll show you what we do with that. <clears throat> I'm gonna mix this up. Might add a little more resin into this blue one just so that it, it's enough for the two coasters. Perfect. You want it to be enough that it's, it's not going to be like pasty. Like, like this one's pasty. I may put more in there. I just want to make sure I have enough resin because I've not used this and I did not. Um, I'm going to pour a little more in my cup. There we go. So we're going to start off with pour, <laughs> wiping this off first. I don't know what that is. There we go. So I'm going to start off with pouring the glitters around and then white in the middle. My oh my. I'm such a messy Marvin. Ah, my fingers. There we go. Where did I put that? I'm going to wipe that right off before I even start. I don't want the pink into the blue. Okay. And then we'll do the blue. I'm just going to give it a quick little stir. Too funny. I'm surprised you guys stay with me. I don't know. I ran out of battery. Battery. So let's get the rest of this glitter in this side. There. I think that'll work. Pour the clear in the center. Just enough. Oh my goodness. So I may have to pour a little bit of that um, white back out of that. That is funny. <clears throat> now I'm going to try. I'm going to use one of my silicone tools <clears throat> and just try and maneuver these glitters. And some of these had pieces of glass in it. I just felt that lump in there. I'm like, what is that? So you have to be careful if you're going to do this to make sure. Oh, there's pink in the bottom of that one. I didn't know I cleaned everything. I just want it to be kind of even. Anyway, we're not going to play with it anymore. Okay, so that's that. I'm going to mix up my white. You do not need a whole lot. This is um, from both of my Lorez distributors, Michelle and Laura both have this. This is Angel White from Lorez. And I'm just 
scraping it all off. <clears throat> and that is all I need. I'd show you the container, but it was a mess. <laughs> so there we go. Give that a quick little stir. There you go. Perfect. I'm going to pour that in. This is just a um, Ziploc bag. Pour that in there. And I'm going to scrape it all out. And we are going to shake it all down to the bottom. Let it sit there for a sec. I'm going to put my alcohol ink in. So we're going to do blue. This one, these are from Pinata. And this one is Baja Blue. Or Baja Blue. And I'm just going to do three in the middle. And then this one, I really want to use my Senorita. Um, this one is pink from Pinata as well. And we'll do three. Perfect. Now, Miss Julie, we're going to give this a little test and see how hot it is. Just, oh. Hmm. I think because it's in a baggie, it's not working quite right. So what I like to do is right off the bat I take my baggie I twist it I'm leaving it a bit loose and I'm cutting off all this excess done so it's not in my way I'm gonna leave my bag a little bit loose and I can't stress this enough the smallest hole that you can cut that's what you want to do so as little as you can I don't even think I cut. Let me see if it's going to come out. No. Nope. Okay. So I'm going to twist this up. My eyes are so bad. <laughs> there is a little hole, but I want it a little bigger than that. How many snips does it take? I'll wipe off my. Yeah, that's too small. I need to get a new pair of scissors. <clears throat> oh, shootles. That's a big one, but we're going to go with it. All right, here we go. So I'm just going to. I don't know how I'm going to do it. I want to do something different because I always do the same pattern. Let's just, let's just do randomness. We're just going to go. And then. I might come back in and do just a second little layer. I 
and I'm going to try and get rid of the blobbies. And that's why you... Oh my goodness, look at the blobs. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going <clears> to... <throat> I have a little bit of a kitty cat here going on. I'm going to pour my rest of this white in here. Waste not, want not. Right, guys? All right. So there we go. So that's that. Now what I'm going to do is come in with one of my silicone paint brushes and try and get rid of these blobs that you see. I'm just going to wipe it off with this. That's it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come in like this. And then swirl in the center. We're going to do two like that. And we're just going to play with some different patterns and see what we can get. And we're going to swirl the center. And this one, we're just going to leave them. We're going to do those that, and we're going to leave this, and we're just going to see what it does. I think these would be cute um, sun catchers. So we're going to leave them like that. I'm going to give it a little bit of a spritz with my alcohol, if I can find it. There it is. And yet, be mindful, guys. Like... If you spray too much of this, you'll get a film. And then also it does dry out your mold. So um, using the alcohol is wonderful, but in moderation. I'm going to do a squirt in my little guy because I see all kinds of little bubbles. And I'm going to fill my heart with this rest of this glitter. Paste. My glitter paste. <laughs> think that'll work and then everything I have used so that took a whole eight which is awesome and I really didn't lose much because um, just the white that's on there so I probably could have gotten away with a little less in my little white container so there we go guys so with that I'm gonna let this sit overnight I'm going to do one more spritz let me just see what have we got in here it feels like there's a big Oh, like I said, there is some glass in there from doing the um, the video. So, okay, so one more spritz. Sorry, there we go. I was getting like half spritz. So that's it. So I'm going to let this cure overnight. And we're just going to see what these guys do. Because I think that it would be kind of cool. Something different. You just get tired of the same old flowers all the time. So I'm hoping it turns out the bloom in this one's going amazing. Love the glitters, Laura. They're always amazing. So with that, I'll see you guys in the morning. Bye-bye. And the button is lost. Hello, I'm back from work and these are cured. This is cool. I'm excited. I'm going to pop them out. And I am going to not show them to you until we get them all out. Oh, 
Oh my, oh my. Oh my, oh my. And a little heart to boot. Let's get that over there. Oh, that's cool. Look at that little heart. That's adorable. I don't know if you can see the holographic on there. That is sweet. All right. So. That one and I think those two and these two. All right. These were the ones done the right way. Look at that pretty blue. Look at that. One, two, three, and here we go. Oh, that is cool. I can see the holographic on there. That is amazing. That is pretty sweet. And then let's look at the pink one. Love the glitters to start off with. Here we go, guys. One, two, three. Oh, you don't want to see it. Do you want to see it? <laughs> Here we go. OMG. Look at that baby. Woohoo. Oh, you can see the holographic. That is gorgeous. Gorgeous, guys. Now, these ones. No, that's the one that. I didn't do anything to it. <gasps> okay. Let's see this one then. Here we go. One, two, three. <gasps> oh my goodness, look at that. Now there's a few blobs, but I like that. That was just that random all over the place. This was the put the stick in and swirl the center. I love both. And look at the holographic. Oh my goodness. That is amazing. Okay, let's look at this pretty pink one. One, two, three, and oh, amazing. They all turned out beautiful. I love it. That is pretty pretty cool well there you go two different ways and to be honest I prefer the just in a circle without doing anything to it these ones almost look like they shifted a little bit but I love both and look at that cute little heart I heart you well there you go my amazing people I hope you enjoyed today's video and I hope you enjoyed the mold. I am impressed with the mold. That's amazing. So I will um, put everything in the description box that I used today. Now the glitters, I'm not sure what the blue one is. It was a bunch of just different glitters like you've seen that I had in this cup from a shake off of a bling bling. So that's amazing. But I do know which ones were in this one. The mag uh, magenta sparkle and pink, pink flamingo and funfetti. That's what's in this one. And magenta sparkle. I'm amazed. That is awesome. I will be making some sun catchers out of these. Maybe not these specific ones, but we will be doing some sun catchers. So with that, please don't forget to comment in the description box if you already have this other mold that I was gifted. If you have this, it, like I said, it's big. It's, it's big. So if you have this already, please, please let me know what you did with it so I'll have an idea. But I was thinking one of these sun catchers in a big form would be beautiful. So with that, my friends, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you um, are already a subscriber, hello, thank you for watching. 
If you are new to my channel, please, please think about hitting that subscription button. Hit that bell up there for notifications. And big thumbs up if you enjoyed today's video. And give it a share if you like it. And with that being said, in the description box, I have the links to everything I used here today. I also have the links to Fundy Molds with a discount code. I have the links to where to purchase Tri Art Liquid Glass. I also have the links to and a discount code for Let's Resin with Sherry M10, capital S, capital M. And I also have the links to where to purchase Tri Crystal Resin which is resin which we used here today and I finally have a discount code and it is Sherry Molten 5 capital S and I also have the two amazing Lares distributors Michelle from Artworks Resin Canada my Canadian Lares distributor also she's got glitter she's got resin she's got everything you think of check out her website use my discount code with Sherry Molten 10 capital S capital M and last but not least, the amazing Laura from Laura's Art Corner. The glitters I used here today. She's also my American Lares distributor, my glitter guru. Check out her website. She's got various stuff other than glitter. But um, my discount code for Laura is all capital letters, Sherry Molten 10. And with that, I have my Amazon links, which I'm affiliate with if you choose to purchase. And I also have my PayPal if you choose to donate and help support my addiction, which is how I purchase these. So with that, I'll see you guys in the next one. I love you guys. Have a wonderful day. See you in the next one. Bye.